what I'm doing is I'm keeping my eyes open here uh, for some mullen stock uh, for a hand drill for fire making. Seems to be where I most often find mullen stock is in areas where the soil has been disturbed. Uh, on the edges of clearings where there's dry, pebbly, sandy soil. Sometimes right in the rocky soils uh, you can find it. And I'm looking for last year's that survived and it's still standing as a dead plant from last year. Now, if you look over my shoulder here somewhere, you might see a van down there. Somebody was having too much fun last night and they got stuck 12 miles from town. Cool. Their backup plan was. Okay, I knew if I looked just a little bit and persisted, I could uh, find some mullen stock, and there it is. There's one there. Here's another one just up the hill from it up there. for a minute to spread any seeds that might still exist within the seed cluster here. It might be a business. Here's a dandy big one. All right, two prospects for hand drills for fire making. See, it's got uh, some crookedness in it, so just not sure what we'll do with it, but there you are. Perhaps that can be my piece of wood.
this way. Alright, there we go. We got our bike, our bark, got our mullen stocks, hand drills. I may resort to a bow drill if I can't get it done with a hand drill. And let's just scar the wood here. Gouge it. As you can see today, I'm uh, not bringing out the, the heavy artillery like axes or hatchets or uh, knives. I've just got my little little saw. So there. Now we're looking at. This piece here I'm looking at most favorably right now for my uh, hearth board. Let's see what else we can pull away from this and make use of. Let that spend some time in the sun. Set this stuff aside. As it clouds over, hey, this uh, will be my one concession today. Uh, is this came out of my possible's bag? fiber, jute twine that I've untwisted and kind of prepped a little bit. Now let's return to our hearth board here and uh, let's get our pilot hole started in that. For that, uh, I'm actually going to go with this uh, thinner spindle here first. Thinner might be drier. All right, let's give that a spin. pilot hole quite a bit deeper here it uh, wants to spin right out of it so see what we can do could use a sharp edge of a rock chip to do this as well I can actually feel the humidity on this wood it's uh, we'll see I'm just going to seek to discover and in the process, we're always learning. Alright, let's see if I can spin that to move down. that rounded. Got my little guide hole working better there. See if we can't some kind of a notch happening here and it'll work. Alright, 
let's try that. Here goes nothing. Producing dust. That's my first little wisp of smoke. What if I cut that off about there? Shorten it just a bit. comes
watch the wind. Quite a bit of dust there. <laughs> 